finals day at the Internazionale Biennale d'Italia in Rome, where two of the WTA's biggest stars were preparing to battle it out for the title. World number one, Serena Williams, and the player who she replaced as number one earlier in the season, Victoria Azarenka. Azarenka was the last player Williams lost to, the American having since embarked on a career-best 23-match winning streak. And she was certainly the overwhelming favourite in the Italian capital, having beaten Azarenka in 11 of their 13 previous meetings. The 31-year-old made the best possible start to her bid for a second Rome title and a 51st WTA crown overall. Serena Williams with a very nice shot there. Azarenka, whose only defeat this season came in Madrid last week, had her chances to break back immediately, but Williams found her best on the big points. Well played point by Azarenka, but Serena Williams just too good in the rally. She goes up two games to love here in this first set. Azarenka yet again has another opportunity to break Serena's serve. But she wouldn't win another game in the set as Williams, who came into the final having only dropped 10 games all tournament, closed it out 6-1. Very strong return of serve by Serena Williams. She takes the opening set here at Internationale BNL d'Italia by a score of 6-1. Azarenka has not been able to put a game together at all. It's all Serena Williams in the first set. The 15-time Grand Slam champion continued in the same vein of form in the second set. It wasn't long before the 2002 Rome winner had moved into a commanding 4-2 lead. Return of serve, too good. Azarenka, aiming to win her 17th WTA title, did her best to keep things competitive. But shots like these would help Williams break again to move 5-3 ahead. Approach to the net, too strong. And at that point, there was only ever going to be one outcome, Williams stealing victory in style. <laughs> Serena Williams extends her win streak to 24 matches on the WTA Tour this year. The win also gives Williams her eighth clay court title, taking her to outright third amongst active players behind her sister Venus and Spain's Annabel Medina Garrigues. She also now has a 33 to one record on the surface since the start of last year's clay court season and is sure to be an overwhelming favorite heading into the French Open. I don't feel the platform like, you know, I couldn't have felt better last year and I didn't do well last year. So, you know, that's why I wanted to do well every day because I don't know what can happen in Paris. Anything can happen. So, you know, just got to take the title whenever I can. This week in Rome has been great. I um, was able to win another title. I haven't won this title in 11 years, which is crazy that I'm 11 years later still playing. Weird, but I'm um, really excited. I love, I love Rome.